of jealousy. There's nothing more that says, I love you, than jealousy. So you and your love buddy boop a nice game of Super Smash Bros. Melee, my favorite game of all time. And you pick Fox, great choice, and then she picks Falco, yet another good choice. And, you know, everything's cool. She asks you a question. She asks, why you pick Fox? And you're like, he's the best in the game, 50-50 matchups against everyone, or better. And then she says, you only pick Fox because your ex plays as her. What? Now you might think that this is a little extreme, but consider that there are relationships out there where if someone's partner literally talks, hangs out, texts, or breathes in the vicinity of someone else, the other person feels that they have to open up the hell of gates and Azura Wrath just rains down on them to control their behavior. Honestly, just check their materia. You can clearly tell if someone's a psycho just by what materia they wear. <sighs> this is scarier than when Spooky Samus follows you around in Metroid Fusion and then looks at the camera. It's crazy to me that people argue that jealousy is a sign of affection, and if you don't have jealousy, then it just means that you don't love the other person enough. This isn't love at all. This is control and manipulation of another person. By doing this, you are essentially saying there is a lack of trust in the other person, which causes unnecessary problems and drama. Even worse is that this is super demeaning. If my partner can't trust me around women, it just implies that she believes I'm one, a liar, or two, I can't control my impulses around other people. If that is the case, I would F-Zero the fuck out of there. This is not someone I would want to be with. To avoid this from being an explosive car crash, you should probably try, you know, trusting the other person. I know, it's an insane idea, but this helps stable the relationship. So go ahead and go into your materialist and find confidence and then combine that with trust and this should work out pretty nicely. Now, some jealousy is natural, but it's when it starts to become excessive and you start having controlling behaviors. This is when it's a sign of your own feelings of unworthiness. Learn to deal with these feelings and don't put them onto others. It will only push your partner further away from you.